In this episode, we are going to cover the Bearing Bearing Intersection Program. This program is used to determine the coordinates of the intersection of two lines on right shift program and make sure you're here at the top of right shift label and we are going to label this program B left shift flags one point zero EQN RCL B RCL R RCL G and we are going to use it for a dash we're going to use this subtract dash RCL B RCL R RCL G right shift space RCL I RCL N RCL T right shift PSE EQN RCL P RCL T right shift space one right shift space RCL N RCL O RCL R RCL T RCL H RCL I RCL N RCL G right shift PSE left shift input N EQN RCL P RCL T right shift space one right shift space RCL E RCL A RCL S RCL T RCL I RCL N RCL G right shift PSE left shift input E EQN RCL P RCL T right shift space one right shift space RCL A RCL Z RCL I RCL M RCL U RCL T RCL H right shift PSE left shift input A EQN RCO 
P, RCL, T, right shift, space, 2, right shift, space, RCL, N, RCL, O, RCL, R, RCL, T, RCL, H, RCL, I, RCL, N, RCL, G. Right shift, PSE, left shift, input, Y. EQN, RCL, P, RCL, T, right shift, space, 2, right shift, space, RCL, E, RCL, A, RCL, S, RCL, T, RCL, I, RCL, N, RCL, G. Right shift, PSE, left shift, input, X. EQN, RCL, P, RCL, T, right shift, space, 2, right shift, space, RCL, A, RCL, Z, RCL, I, RCL M RCL U RCL T RCL H Right shift PSE Left shift Flags 2 Point zero left shift input Z RCL A left shift HMS tan. 1 over x, right shift, stow, a, rcl, z, left shift, hms, tan, 1 over x, Right shift, so, Z, EQN, parentheses, parentheses, RCL, Y, minus, RCL, N, right arrow, minus, RCL, X, times, RCL, Z, 
plus RCL E times RCL A right arrow divided parentheses RCL A minus RCL Z EQN enter right shift STO E EQN RCL Y plus parentheses RCL E minus RCL X right arrow times RCL Z EQN enter right shift STO N left shift flags one point zero EQN RCL N RCL O RCL R RCL T RCL H RCL I RCL N RCL G right shift PSE left shift view N EQN RCL E RCL A RCL S RCL T RCL I RCL N RCL G right shift PSE left shift flags two point zero left shift view E XY left shift RTN and now I will go to the top of the program and then you guys can double check make sure everything matches okay And for line 34 and 36, I'll put those in the description of this video.
Here we have two known points, point 130 and point 139. We have the northing and eastings and azimuths for both of those. And we are after the northing and eastings of point 131. That point is where those two lines intersect. Also, it does not matter what order the coordinates are entered. You don't have to enter them in a clockwise or counterclockwise order. Make sure to enter the azimuths and not the bearings. And the azimuths entered need to be to the right of the point. And now we will test out our new program with the example that we have. So right shift program. X E Q B enter. And this is going to be the northing for the first point, which is point 130. It's 4000. RS. The easting for the first point, which is point 130, is 5000. And now the azimuth, which is 5 degrees, point 48 minutes and 52 seconds. RS. And this is going to be the northing for our second point, which is point 139, 4199.832 RS. And this is going to be the easting for point 139, 4985.329 RS. In the azimuth, 85 degrees, 48 minutes, and half a second, RS. And this is the northing for point 131. This is where the two lines are intersecting at. RS, and this is the easting for that same point. RS, back, enter, left shift, and off. See you guys in the next episode.